watching and we're back from all Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. In the last episode, we finished up C3, and then this episode, we're going to be C4. Again. Yes, I'm actually gonna talk in cutscenes. Um, uh, in the last video, I asked you guys if I should talk in cutscenes or not, and you guys said I should because it mainly interrupts my sentences, and I actually agree. I just want to be courteous to you guys and uh, see what you guys thought first. I don't even know why I was quiet for Egad's sermon or whatever, but you know. I guess just force of habit or something. Anyways, welcome to the second and final, uh, Pulsar Pup mission. But first out, while well, I like to explain this, uh, as you saw, he had a shield on, which he had infinite health while the shield was up. There are three different kinds of shields on ghosts that can appear. Um, there is a blue shield, which requires the blue level of suction, which is the first level of suction, to, uh, break. We have the uh, green one, which takes the second level, and then the red one, which takes the third level of suction. So yes, um, this is the first mission that I appear in, I believe. Uh, I actually thought it was the next mission, but apparently it's this one, while I'm um, looking through the footage beforehand, so, nah. Also, I apologize for lack of upload on this. Like, I know it wasn't such a big gap, uh, not as big of a gap as, uh, b -b -b between C... 2 and C3, but I, I just have been pretty busy with Rayman, especially with my new capture card and stuff, like files have been taking longer to, like, work and stuff, which is actually, uh, pretty like, I, when I initially started Rayman, I didn't actually think it would, uh, take up that much time and it wouldn't really hinder my normal uploads, when it didn't, and it actually didn't when I first did it on my diamond. But now that I got my Algato, it's taking up a lot of my computer time, so man, I might um, stop that series soon. It depends uh, what you guys want. I really enjoy it though. So, anyways, if you uh, dark like that lantern, uh, the boo appears, so be sure to get that. If you do want the uh, secret mission, the boo mission, boo unlockable mission for this uh, mansion, which is uh, pretty much. It w wasn't it that, uh, Ghost Gauntlet? I'm not too sure. I haven't played this game in a while. But yeah, I'm actually, for a second, I'm gonna actually talk about the game for once. Ooh, that's a new thing. No, I want to talk about the Polter Pop mission. This is the last Polter Pop mission, um, and we are about halfway through the game right now. Uh, I'm actually kind of sad about this because the Polter Pop missions are fun, like... They're really short, but they're really fun. Maybe they could make it a bit longer or something. I don't know. It's something that you may not even be able to make longer because it's kind of repetitive after a while. But I really like the pull the pup missions. Maybe they should have made like a harder one or something. Oh wait, now on second thought, this actually isn't the last pull to pup mission. Wait, I totally made a mistake. This isn't the last pull to pup mission. I'm so stupid. Uh, this is the, uh, there's three pull to pop missions and this is the, uh, uh, second. I just, uh, forgot because next mansion won't have a pull to pop mission, but then the mansion after that will, so, yeah. They just skip a mansion for it, and I'll explain that when the mansion actually comes, but. Yeah, I made a total mistake. As you see here, he comes through the, uh, ceiling, so that's why we went all the way around, because he pops through the ceiling. And yay, Porter Puppies! My favorite. My favorite character in this game. It's awesome! Oh my god, I love Polter Pup. I love Polter Pup. It's just a great character design, and uh, I don't know. I just always have a soft spot for those type of characters. Those instant little, like, constant positive characters. They're always just fun in the sun. 
fun in the sun. I'm acting so gay right now. Uh, no offense to the, uh, homosexual people at all. Um, uh, I probably like homosexual people more than, uh, regular people in general. Anyways, enough talk about that. Uh, we don't want to go into personal details, because I consider... That, I guess that could be personal to some people. I don't know. It really depends on the personality uh, of the person. But, yeah. I usually want to avoid talking about that because personal stuff is personal. Like, list of stuff. Okay, when let's playing. The, like, the list of stuff to avoid. Religion. Uh, worldly problems that are sensitive. Uh, personal things. All that. I don't know. I just, like, was redundant right there. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Bull Black Tree said, boom, shut down. <laughs> Hello, this is Bull Black Tree, and I'm back for more episodes. Hey, why did the video start in the middle of the episode? I thought we had to listen to you again. <laughs> Anyways. Um, I do have a fade memory of, like, commentating this before, but I think it was maybe in a dream. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I'm not a robot, guys. Oh, and I love that frame. It's just like, it's just like when you come in, it's like a still frame of like that, the dog and his tongue's out. And it's just like, ah. so cool. I don't know. I just love derpy things. That's why I uh, made my Emperor, Emperor Ball Blacks so derpy, because I knew its tongue came out like, uh, in the game, and then I uh, was like, hey, maybe I can make that a derp sign. And if you notice, like, if you follow me on Twitter or ever see me type in the comments or anything, uh, I use, or like any social media, even on like Miiverse or whatever, or Wii U or something, I always, m my number one used emoticon is colon P, the derp sign. I'm just a derpy, derpy fella. Anyways, right here we have to do a triple E, triple E, triple E, triple E, uh, suction to break that shield. That'll actually get annoying in the future. It appears, like, almost on every, like, it gradually appears on more and more ghosts throughout the game, and then by the end of the game, like, almost every ghost has it, so, uh, I don't know. Anyways, we're actually about at the end of this mission. This is a r gonna be a really short video, under 10 minutes. I'm sorry for the short episode, but you know, short mission, it's Nintendo's fault, not mine. Blame Nintendo, sue Nintendo, it's not my fault, it's not my fault. But maybe, just maybe, you'll see another Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon episode, uh, sooner. As in, not a week away, god. I'm so bad with uploading this lately, it's just, uh, it's just horrible. I am completely sorry, because I know currently this is my most viewed series. Okay, guys, I'm sorry there. Something actually just happened, but I am back for the last few minutes of this video, and uh, I believe I was talking about this being my most viewed series. Yes, this is my most viewed series, um, and I'm sorry for not uploading this too often, but if you do want something to watch, do watch my Minish Cap Let's Play, because I'm actually having a lot of fun with that, and it's probably one of my favorite Let's Plays I've ever recorded, like, so far. Anyways, what you have to do is, like, strobe and then quickly, like, slowly, not quickly, sneak up on the uh, Polter Pop. If you go straight for him, he will dash into the room and you'll have to do that little bomb segment again, which is pretty annoying. But anyways, we basically got the last hand, um, for the mission. Well, not the last hand. Well, wait. Yeah, this is the last hand, so I have both of the hands now. But I mean, I said the last hand for this mission. There's only one hand in the mission, so meh. Anyways, I'm just being weird. Anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. In the next episode, we will be doing C5, which is actually the last normal mission for this mansion. And hopefully it will be actually uploaded soon, like in under a week. Anyways, um, if you like this video, please like it. And if you really liked it, please consider subscribing. It would help me a lot. And yes, I got silver rank, not gold this time, so meh. Anyways, I've been Bull Blacks, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye!